हेलो स्टूडेंट्स स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू जोमेट्री स्कूल स्टूडेंट्स टुडे आई विल गेट यू द करंट अफेयर फॉर द मंथ ऑफ फेबररी एंड दिस इज पार्ट टू एंड दिस वीडियो विल बी इन इंग्लिश लैंग्वेज आई विल नॉट यूज हिंदी लैंग्वेज बिकॉज देर आर सो मैनी स्टूडेंट्स हु हैव प्रॉब्लम टू अंडरस्टैंड द हिंदी सो वी हैव डिसाइडेड टू प्रोड्यूस टू वीडियोज वन इज हिंदी मीडियम एंड वन इज इंग्लिश मीडियम सो दिस इज इंग्लिश मीडियम पार्ट एंड Uh, for what type of exam this video will cover this will cover the RIMC exam that is going to be held in june 2022 june 2022 another exam the date for this exam has been announced now the exam will be conducted on 3rd april 3rd april 2022 and the call letter uh, downloading will start from uh, 10th march so this will cover uh, this exam also and there is a very little part that comes in the uh, exam of all india sanic school entrance examination here you will get help from this current affair section understand here i want to uh, inform you that while after watching this video you have to do practice and how will you do practice okay let i will uh, take you to the official website www.geometryschool.in and and uh, uh, yes actually you have to write a google geometry school you will uh, get this official website then this is our official website then here is quiz section here is quiz section here is quiz section and in the quiz section you will get rashtri and military college okay this is free there is no cost and you have to practice the question after watching the video actually students it is not sufficient that you watch the video again and again and you will get the questions uh, in your memory no it is not possible you have to practice it so like as this is january 2022 all the uh, current affairs has been converted in the forms of quiz okay all the current affairs here january uh, current affair part 1 part 2 part 3 here february i start this quiz okay you have to enroll okay let's let let me enroll first i i, I will log in and, uh, and this is yes and uh, uh, actually it is not sufficient that you watch the video again and again and and uh, practice the question no it is not uh, sufficient you have to enroll in this and this is uh, there is no cost for enrolling this is free this is completely free like as we have uploaded january uh, 2022 all the four parts of current affair and february 2022 all the four parts uh, all the one part and this is second part so this is february i am going to start the quiz you have to yes yes you will notice uh, that that this is a question these are the questions of part 1 current affair february you have to attempt you have to attempt this question okay you have to attempt this question and practice uh, through the quiz section also okay so uh, in spite of uh, watching the videos only you have to practice the questions through the quiz section okay students so so let's start and uh, for the uh, questions today these are our live batches you can join uh, rimc live batch for the june session rms crash course all india sanic school you have to call on these numbers these are our official number to join the live classes at least you should take demo first take the demo and then decide uh, is there difference or not you will certainly find uh, uh, a very good quality of education through our live classes so at least i suggest you you should take demo demo class okay this is our champion batch you can join the champion batch for the rms that the exam is going to held on uh, 3rd april 2022 there are so many students uh, who are not compatible with uh, online education they want uh, to take the education from hostel facility so we have physical campus also just do visit our physical campus and uh, decide if you are interested in offline coaching then you can take offline coaching over physical campus what will we provide we provide dedicated classes group discussion mess and canteen the facility is very good sports activity students uh, i want to suggest you one thing uh, don't take uh, the coaching from those sports where sports uh, and exercise is not available because it has been noticed that there are so many institution who provide who 
put up all the students in a room and they don't provide the uh, games activity so it is not possible for especially your age ch children to uh, study 18 hours without game act activity it is not possible you have to play at least 2 hours per day then your mind will work because your age is uh, around 10 years so at the age of 10 years uh, the students the children the child has to be involved in games activity okay games activity so i suggest you join nandoj coaching centers who provide uh, sports facility and other facilities but sports facilities must okay so these are our official uh, these are our rimc and sainik school online courses you can join these live batches we have recorded video also you can uh, uh, watch the demo videos from recorded they are high, high they are they are also very good uh, and rms courses these are our recorded rms courses if you uh, if you don't have any uh, sufficient time for the complete course you can watch our recorded courses okay these are for ninth classes so student today i will uh, get you the part 2 of february 2022 current affairs section so let's start so this is the burning questions of the uh, previous video uh, match the following match the following these types of questions frequently ask in rimc exam rimc exam okay in the rms exam the question will come on, uh, come only in single single form that the what is the capital of tanzania this part will come but in rimc exam these types of questions are asked in bunch clear so Tanzania capital is Dodoma, this is this, Sudan capital is Khartoum, Senegal capital is Dakar, Ethiopia capital is Addis Ababa. So these are the uh, correct uh, pair of uh, these correct joining of, of the questions, correct uh, capitals of the uh, countries. Okay, so today's question number one, who has been appointed as the director of Vikram Sarabhai Space Center. So, Vikram Sarabhai Space Center director has been appointed. Mr. Dr. S. Unni Krishnan Nair. Dr. S. Unni Krishnan Nair is the correct answer. There are some certain important th things about Vikram Sarabhai Space Center V double S C. Its headquarter is located in Tiruvanthapuram. 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 And Tiruvanthapuram is the capital of Kerala. Okay. Another important thing. Uh, who was the first director of Vikram Sarabhai Space Center? Brahm Prakash was the first director. And Vikram Sarabhai Space Center. Can you uh, tell me who was Vikram Sarabhai? Vikram Sarabhai was first ISRO chief. First ISRO Indian Space Research Organization ISRO chief. Was Vikram Sarabhai. And he was also known as father of Indian space program. This question has come uh, once in RIMC. Who is known as father of Indian space program? Father of Indian space program. Father of Indian space program is known as Vikram Sharabhai. Clear. And uh, uh, Dr. S. Somnath. Who is Dr. S. Somnath? Dr. S. Somnath is current ISRO chief current isro chief is dr s somna so next question the correct answer is option c uh, during the video i will tell you some important facts they are very important you have to remember those facts also because it is not possible to uh, to get expertise in uh, in static gk without current affair without current affair you have to uh, prepare both current affair as well as static gk simultaneously it is not possible that independently first you will pre prepare current affair and then later i will uh, i will attack on the static gk that will face very uh, difficulty so we will uh, we will prepare static gk as well as current affairs which state is going to conduct country's first ever wa water bird census so, country's first water world census will be conducted by Telangana. 
द द स्टेट इज तेलंगाना करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन बी एंड देर आर सम इम्पोर्टेंट नेशनल पार्क एंड अदर प्लेसेज अबाउट तेलंगाना सो दीज आर सम इम्पोर्टेंट प्लेसेज चार मीनार चार मीनार इज द मोन्यूमेंट दैट इज आस फ्रिक्वेंटली इन द एग्जाम रामोजी फिल्म सिटी चोहमल्ला प्लेस एंड हुसैन सागर लेक एंड गोलकोंडा फोर्ट दीज आर फाइव इम्पोर्टेंट प्लेसेज इम्पोर्टेंट मोन्यूमेंट्स एंड वाटर बॉडीज लाइक हुसैन सागर लेक यू हैव टू रिमेंबर द क्वेश्चन आज हुसैन सागर लेक इज लोकेटेड इन विच स्टेट दिस टाइप ऑफ क्वेश्चन फ्रिक्वेंटली आस्क इन आर आई एम सी एंड आर एम एस एंड सैनिक स्कूल एग्जाम्स क्लियर अनदर ओके चार मीनार रामोजी फिल्म सिटी चोमल्ला प्लेस हुसैन सागर लेक एंड गोलकोंडा फोर्ट्स आर लोकेटेड इन तेलंगाना देर आर टू नेशनल पार्क दैट आर लोकेटेड इन तेलंगाना वन इज मुरुगावनी नेशनल पार्क एंड अनदर इज के बी आर काशुनन ब्रह्मान काशु ब्रह्मानंद रेड्डी नेशनल पार्क क्लियर दीज आर टू नेशनल पार्क दैट आर लोकेटेड इन तेलंगाना तेलंगाना द कैपिटल इज हैदराबाद एंड हैदराबाद इज शमशाबाद एयरपोर्ट इन हैदराबाद द एयरपोर्ट इज राजीव गांधी इंटरनेशनल एयरपोर्ट और शमशाबाद एयरपोर्ट ओके देर आर टू इम्पोर्टेंट फोक डांस फोक फेस्टिवल ऑफ तेलंगाना वन इज बटुकम्मा फ्लोवर फेस्टिवल बटुकम्मा देर देर कैन बी अस्टेक इन स्पेलिंग सो डोंट कंसिडर दैट बिकॉज स्पेलिंग डजेंट मैटर इन जी के ओके एंड अनदर इज बोनालू बोनालू फेस्टिवल ओके दीज आर टू इम्पोर्टेंट फेस्टिवल दैट आर सेलिब्रेटेड बाई तेलंगाना पीपल एंड तेलंगाना इन तेलंगाना देर इज अ सिटी वंस दिस क्वेश्चन हैज बीन आफ देर इज अ सिटी दैट इज सिकंदराबाद सिकंदराबाद एंड द क्वेश्चन वाज आस विच सिटी इज नोन एज ट्विन सिटी सिकंदराबाद इज नोन एज ट्विन सिटी बिकॉज सिकंदराबाद इज अ ट्विन सिटी ऑफ हैदराबाद ओके ट्विन सिटी ऑफ हैदराबाद तो दिस क्वेश्चन हैज बीन आस्क वंस सिकंदराबाद इज अ ट्विन सिटी ऑफ हैदराबाद ओके सो एंड तेलंगाना चीफ मिनिस्टर के सी आर चंद्रशेखर राव एंड तोमिल साई सौंदराजन इज द गवर्नर ऑफ तेलंगाना दीज आर सम इम्पोर्टेंट फैक्ट्स अबाउट तेलंगाना सो आंसर इज बी नेक्स्ट मूव टू द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन वर्ल्ड रेडियो डे इज ऑब्जर्व ऑन विच डे वर्ल्ड रेडियो डे इज ऑब्जर्व ऑन थर्टीन फेबररी द करेक्ट आंसर इज थर्टीन फेबररी एंड वट इज द थीम फॉर द वर्ल्ड रेडियो डे टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी टू रेडियो एंड ट्रस्ट रेडियो एंड ट्रस्ट इज द थीम ओके देर इज देर इज अनदर इम्पोर्टेंट डे दैट इज सेलिब्रेटेड ऑन थर्टीन फेबररी दैट इज नेशनल वुमेन्स डे नेशनल वुमेन्स डे द बर्थडे ऑफ सरोजनी नायडू वाई डू वी सेलिब्रेट नेशनल वुमेन्स डे थर्टीन फेबररी इज सेलिब्रेटेड एज बर्थडे ऑफ सरोजनी नायडू ओके इंटरनेशनल वुमेन्स डे इज सेलिब्रेटेड ऑन एट मार्च डोंट मिक्स इंटरनेशनल वुमेन्स डे विद नेशनल वुमेन्स डे दीज आर कंप्लीटली डिफरेंट ओके सो नेशनल वुमेन्स डे इज सेलिब्रेटेड ऑन थर्टीन फेबररी बट वर्ल्ड रेडियो डे इज थर्टीन फेबररी एंड रेडियो एंड ट्रस्ट द थीम फॉर द ईयर टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी टू Which Union Territory will host World Cup Cycling Event in September 2022? So, as you know, as you know, there are uh, eight Union Territories and 28 states. Okay, what are they? Eight? Can you tell me the name of eight Union ter Territories? Yes, Ladakh, J and K, Delhi, Puducherry, Chandigarh, Dadra and Nagar Haveli, Andaman and Nicobar. These are Uh, eight union territories and you have to remember the capital as well so the correct answer of this question is ladakh ladakh will be the uh, union territory that will host world cup cycling event in september 2022 understand so there are some static information that i want to give you about ladakh india's largest india's largest india's largest national park 
is located in Ladakh. The name is Hamish National Park. Hamish National Park. And uh, there is a lake in Ladakh, Pangong So Lake. Pangong So Lake. Pangong So Lake. The meaning of So is also lake. So Pangong So Lake is located in Ladakh. And why is Pangong So Lake is so famous? Because Pangong So Lake has the 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 water the uh, water of this lake has the ability to change its shades of blue to green to red okay it's uh, it's uh, uh, it's it's popular for changing color ability okay Ch ch changing its color or and and uh, there, uh, there uh, actually uh, there was a point when india and china soldiers get uh, uh, con conflicted and india uh, uh, killed around 40 soldiers of of china brave uh, moment for india okay so the correct answer is ladakh next question jiva agro ecology based program is launched by which organization so this is a program for agro agriculture related activity so the uh, when you heard the name agriculture related activity the only institution that work for agriculture related that is nabard nabard okay that's why i added this question because i want to give you the information that nabard is a institution that works for the welfare of agriculture okay and uh, uh, what is the full form of nabard national bank for agriculture and rural development okay okay rural development similar since rbi is the central bank reserve bank of india in the same way national bank for agriculture and rural rural development that works for the upliftment of agriculture uh, area agricultural farmer activity okay and who is the chairman of nabar rbi governor is sakti kanta das this question can be asked and the head office is mumbai in the similar manner nabar chairman man is g r chintala g r chintala and head office is in mumbai okay minister of agriculture who is union cabinet minister for agriculture narendra singh tomar narendra singh tomar okay so next question so the correct answer is option number b india is ranked in the eiu economist intelligence eiu full form is economist intelligence unit e miss economist i miss intelligence unit okay e i use democracy index 2021 so what is the rank of india e i u democracy index so basically in the question the question basically the question is about democracy which country is the uh, best democracy and what is the rank of india at international level in the terms of democracy so india's rank is 46 India's rank is 46. Uh, correct the option. Option is A. India's rank is 46. And uh, where is the headquarter of EIU? Economist Intelligence Unit. Its headquarter is in London. The capital of England. And uh, there are some important facts that I want to uh, tell you about the EIU Democracy Index. The democracy index is based on 60 indicators grouped into five categories electoral electoral process, pluralism, civil liberties, functioning of government. These, these are some important categories and parameters. Countries are given a rating in this uh, uh, ranking. A rating is given and the scale for the rating is 0 to 10. 0 to 10. Each country is grouped into four, four types of region, four types of democracies like a full democracy full democracy flawed democracy hybrid regime and authoritarian so india is flawed democracy india is not a full democracy 
इंडिया इज नॉट अ फुल डेमोक्रेसी इंडिया कम्स अंडर द ग्रुप ऑफ फ्लोर डेमोक्रेसी ओके एंड सम कंट्रीज कम्स अंडर द ग्रुप ऑफ अथोरोटेरियन लाइक एज अफगानिस्तान अफगानिस्तान इज द लीस्ट डेमोक्रेटिक कंट्री एंड दिस कंट्री कम इन द रिजीम ऑफ अथोरोटेरियन म्यांमार नॉर्थ कोरिया हेयर इज नो डेमोक्रेसी ओके द पीपल ऑफ दिस कंट्री डू नॉट इलेक्ट देयर रिप्रजेंटेटिव ओके बट देयर आर सम कंट्रीज हु हैव फुल डेमोक्रेसी स्कोर लाइक एज नॉर्वे न्यूजीलैंड फिनलैंड स्वीडन दैट इज स्कैंडीनेवियन एंड नॉर्डिक कंट्री दीज आर नॉर्डिक एंड स्कैंडीनेवियन नॉर्डिक कंट्रीज एंड स्कैंडीनेवियन ओके सो यूरोपियन कंट्री बेसिकली सो दे आर दे हैव द स्कोर ऑफ नाइन पॉइंट सेवन फाइव नाइन पॉइंट सेवन फाइव मीन्स द स्कोर इज जीरो टू टेन टेन इज द हाइएस्ट दे आर नियरली नियरली इक्वल टू द और सेम एज टेन सो दे आर फुल डेमोक्रेसी बट इंडिया स्कोर इज वेरी लो इंडिया इज रैंक एट फोर्टी सिक्स नेम द कंट्री दैट हैज बिकम फर्स्ट एवर कंट्री टू अलाउ ड्रोन फ्लाइट इन सिविलियन एयर स्पेस सो द फर्स्ट कंट्री दैट हैज बिकम दैट इज इजराइल द करेक्ट आंसर इज इजराइल इजराइल वट इज द कैपिटल ऑफ इजराइल इजराइल कैपिटल इज जेरूसलैम कैपिटल इज जेरूसलम फ्रांस कैपिटल इज पेरिस चाइना बीजिंग इक्विडोर कैपिटल इज क्विटो एंड क्विटो इज द प्लेस फ्रॉम वेयर इक्वेटर पास इट इज अ नॉर्थ अमेरिकन कंट्री दे आर थ्री नॉर्थ अमेरिक सॉरी दिस इज अन साउथ अमेरिकन कंट्री देर आर थ्री साउथ अमेरिकन कंट्री दैट इज इक्वेटर कंबोडिया एंड एंड ब्राजील दैट इक्वेटर पास ओके बिकॉज वंस इट वंस इट दिस टाइप ऑफ क्वेश्चन हैज बीन आस्क फ्रॉम विच कंट्री इक्वेटर डज नॉट पास ओके डज नॉट पास देर आर अराउंड ट्वेल्व टू फिफ्टीन कंट्रीज थ्रू विच द इक्वेटर पास इज सो दिस टाइप ऑफ क्वेश्चन आस्क बट य इजराइल करेंसी इज शकिल ओके चाइना इज यूआन रेनमेन बी फ्रांस वट इज द करेंसी ऑफ फ्रांस यूरो एंड इक्वेडोर करेंसी इट इज यस आई डोंट आई वट इज द करेंसी ऑफ इक्वेडोर एक्चुअली इट यूज इज द यूनाइट यू एस ए डॉलर यू एस ए डॉलर दे यूज द करेंसी ऑफ यूनाइटेड स्टेट डॉलर दे डोंट हैव देयर ओन करेंसी ओके सो नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन द फर्स्ट मशीन इन इंडिया टू प्रिवेंट कैंसर नेम्ड एज होप एक्सप्रेस इज रिसेंटली लॉन्च बाय विच स्टेट सो विच स्टेट है लॉन्च होप एक्सप्रेस मशीन दैट विल प्रिवेंट कैंसर द आंसर इज महाराष्ट्र द आंसर इज महाराष्ट्र ओके एंड देर आर सम इम्पोर्टेंट थिंग्स अबाउट महाराष्ट्र दैट इज नेशनल फर्स्ट लेट मी टेल यू द नेशनल पार्क देर आर सेवन फाइव सिक्स टू सेवन नेशनल पार्क देर आर चंदोली नेशनल पार्क गुगामल नेशनल पार्क नवेगांव नेशनल पार्क पेंच एंड पेंच इज ऑल्सो इन मध्य प्रदेश ऑल्सो पेंच टाइगर रिजर्व एंड संजय गांधी नेशनल पार्क एंड तडोबा नेशनल पार्क दीज आर इम्पोर्टेंट सिक्स नेशनल पार्क दैट आर लोकेटेड इन महाराष्ट्र सो यू हैव टू रिमेंबर दीज ओके एंड वाट आर द इम्पोर्टेंट फोक डांस ऑफ महाराष्ट्र देर आर टू इम्पोर्टेंट फोक डांस ऑफ महाराष्ट्र वन इज लवानी लावणी लवानी एंड अनादर इज तमाशा There are two important, uh, uh, two to three important world heritage site, Ajanta and Elora's caves. Ajanta and Elora's caves. Bibi ka makbara. Bibi ka makbara. And Soneri Mahal. These all are located in Aurangabad. It is not sufficient that. you remember it in maharashtra it is not sufficient you have to remember the district of aurangabad okay aurangabad these all the three sites are located in aurangabad okay and uh, gateway of india there are two things one is india gate and another is gateway of india 
गेट वे ऑफ इंडिया इज लोकेटेड इन महाराष्ट्र मुंबई एंड इंडिया गेट इज लोकेटेड इन दिल्ली डोंट कंफ्यूज विद इंडिया गेट एंड गेट वे ऑफ इंडिया ओके सो नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन विच एयर क्राफ्ट विल पार्टिसिपेट इन सिंगापुर एयर शो टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी टू सो विच एयर क्राफ्ट विल पार्टिसिपेट दर इज तेजस एम के वन तेजस एम के वन ओके एंड वी डू मिलिट्री एक्सरसाइज नेवल मिलिट्री मिलिट्री एक्सरसाइज नेवल एक्सरसाइज विद सिंगापुर द कैपिटल इज सिंगापुर सिटी इज अक कंट्री इट इज अशियान कंट्री सो आशियान कंट्री सिंगापुर कम्स इन द ग्रुप ऑफ आशियान ग्रुप ओके देर आर टेन कंट्रीज इन आशियान सो सिंगापुर इज अ पार्ट ऑफ आशियान ग्रुप सो वट वट इज द मिलिट्री एक्सरसाइज दैट वी डू विद सिंगापुर दैट इज सिम्बैक्स एस आई एम बी ई एक्स सिम्बैक्स सिंगापुर इंडिया मेरी टाइम बायोलेट्रल एक्सरसाइज ओके दिस इज द फुल फॉर्म ऑफ सिम्बैक्स सो इट इज यू कैन एज्यूम यू कैन गैस फ्रॉम द नेम दैट एम दिस इज अ मेरी टाइम एक्सरसाइज दिस इज अ नेवल एक्सरसाइज Who is known as the Night Angle of India or Bharat Ko Kila? So the correct answer is Sarojini Naidu. In the previous video, I have told you that Night Angle of India, since that the Lata Mangeshkar um, passed away recently, so I told you that uh, she is also. But uh, to some extent, she was also known as Night Angle of India. But at a broader scale, at a large scale, if the question comes. and there is a option of sarojini naidu then you have to mark sarojini naidu because the title of night angle of india to sarojini naidu was given by mahatma gandhi that's why the, the that's why sarojini naidu is important and when do we celebrate the birthday of sarojini naidu the birthday of sarojini naidu is celebrated as 13 february as 13 feb as national women's day this is more important question than this national women's day okay at the international level we celebrate uh, uh, 8th march at the international women's day but at national level at india level we celebrated at on 13th february that is national women's day birthday of sarojini naidu and who was sarojini naidu sarojini naidu was the second president second woman president of indian national congress second woman president of woman woman president of of inc this is important one and uh, who was the first any basent was the first president of indian national congress woman president i am talking about woman and who, if the question comes who 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 was the first uh, woman governor of india of any states because governor uh, is appointed of the, as a state head so who was the first woman governor so it was sarojini naidu Are for which state she elected as a governor? So the state was United Province, that is Uttar Pradesh. United Uttar Pradesh, United Province. The older name of Uttar Pradesh was United Province. Okay, so these are some important uh, uh, questions, uh, important facts, important information that you have to kept in your mind. Next question, the correct answer is option D. What will be the name of Ahmedabad IPL teams? As you know, there are ten IPL teams in this session. From the session two thousand twenty-two, the total number of IPL teams will be ten. Till now, there are eight IPL teams, but from the two thousand twenty-two April session, there will be ten IPL teams. So, new two new IPL team has been included. One is Ahmedabad IPL, and another is Lucknow. so what is the name what is the official name for amdavad ipl team the correct answer is gujarat titans gujarat titans and who will be the captain hardik pandya will be the captain hardik pandya hardik pandya will be the captain of gujarat titans and there is another important new team there is another new team that is lucknow lucknow The, the capital city of Uttar Pradesh, Lucknow is located in on Gomti River. Gomti River, Bada Imam Bada and Chhota Imam Bada are located in Lucknow. And Gomti, Gomti River, Gomti, G O M T I, Gomti River. Okay, 
एंड द नेम ऑफ लखनऊ टीम इज लखनऊ सुपर जायट्स लखनऊ सुपर जायट्स एंड हु विल बी द कैप्टन द कैप्टन विल बी के एल राहुल द कैप्टन विल बी के एल राहुल एंड दिस इज द दिस विल बी द फिफ्टीन दिस विल बी द फिफ्टीन सेशन ऑफ आई पी एल फिफ्टीन सेशन ऑफ आई पी एल एंड वेन वॉज द फर्स्ट सेशन ऑफ आई पी एल हैपन द फर्स्ट सेशन वॉज द फर्स्ट सेशन वॉज हेल्ड ऑन टू थाउजेंड एट एंड द विनर ऑफ द फर्स्ट सेशन वॉज राजस्थान रॉयल्स राजस्थान रॉयल्स एंड हु इज द विनर ऑफ द टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी वन सेशन हुनर वॉज द विनर द विनर वॉज चेन्नई सुपर किंग्स दे डिफिटेड के के आर कोलकाता नाइट राइडर्स ओके सो दीज आर सम इंपॉर्टेंट फैक्ट यू हैव टू रिमेंबर सो नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन द करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन नंबर ए इंडियाज फर्स्ट बायोमेस बेस्ड हाइड्रोजन प्लांट विल बी सेटअप इन विच स्टेट सो द इंडियाज फर्स्ट बायोमेस बेस्ड हाइड्रोजन प्लांट विल बी सेटअप इन मध्य प्रदेश द करेक्ट आंसर इज मध्य प्रदेश एंड इन मध्य प्रदेश द डिस्ट्रिक्ट इज खांडवा डिस्ट्रिक्ट खांडवा डिस्ट्रिक्ट ओके खांडवा डिस्ट्रिक्ट एंड देर आर सो मैनी नेशनल पार्क इन मध्य प्रदेश अराउंड टेन नेशनल पार्क आर लोकेटेड इन मध्य प्रदेश लाइक एज कहना कहना नेशनल पार्क कूनो नेशनल पार्क पन्ना नेशनल पार्क पेंच नेशनल पार्क बांधवगढ़ नेशनल पार्क सतपुड़ा माधव दीज आर इंपोर्टेंट नेशनल पार्क दैट आर लोकेटेड इन मध्य प्रदेश एंड इन मध्य प्रदेश देर इज अ यूनेस्को वर्ल्ड हेरिटेज साइट दैट इज खुजराओ 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 इज अ यूनेस्को वर्ल्ड हेरिटेज साइट दैट इज लोकेटेड इन मध्य प्रदेश देर इज अनदर इंपॉर्टेंट प्लेस सांची स्तूप सांची स्तूप इज ऑल्सो लोकेटेड इन मध्य प्रदेश एंड एंड देर आर टू इंपोर्टेंट फोक डांस ऑफ मध्य प्रदेश दैट इज जवारा जे ए डब्ल्यू ए आर ए जवारा एंड जवारा एंड मटकी जवारा एंड मटकी दीज आर इंपोर्टेंट फोक डांस ऑफ मध्य प्रदेश एंड देर इज अ प्लेस इन मध्य प्रदेश दैट इज ओरछा ओरछा ओ आर सी एच ए ओरछा वट इज ओरछा ओरछा इज अ हिस्टोरिकल टाउन लोकेटेड ऑन द बैंक्स ऑफ रिवर बेतवा ओके इट इज अ हिस्टोरिकल टाउन एंड फॉर विच फॉर विच फॉर फॉर वट इट इज फेमस इट इज फेमस फॉर इट्स ग्रैंड प्लेसिस ग्रैंड प्लेसिस जी आर ए एन डी ग्रैंड पैलेसिस पैलेसिस ओके दैट्स वाई ओरछा इज ओरछा टाउन इज फेमस एंड इट इज अ यूनेस्को हेरिटेज साइट ऑल्सो ओरछा द करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन बी नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन Which state is ranked number one in solar electrification under Sobhagya scheme? What is the full form Sobhagya? Sobhagya is Sahaj Bijli Argar Yojana. Okay, the state is number one. One number one is Rajasthan. The correct answer is Rajasthan, and the capital of Rajasthan is Jaipur. Capital of Rajasthan is Jaipur, and Jaipur is known as. There are two to three cities in Jaipur. Jaipur is known as Pink City. Jodhpur is known as Blue City. Jodhpur is blue blue city, and another is Jaisalmer. Golden city. So these three cities are named are known as for their name uh, color. Jaipur pink, Jodhpur blue, and Jaisalmer is golden city. There uh, is a uh, tiger reserve national. There is an important uh, national park, the tiger reserve, and Thambo tiger reserve. run thambor tiger reserve you have to remember rawat bhata nuclear power plant rawat bhata nuclear power plant is also located in madhya pradesh uh, in uh, rajasthan and pus there uh, is a fair that is puskar camel fair puskar camel fair that is uh, uh, organized in uh, in uh, rajasthan and there is a hill station that is mount abu is the highest point of madhya uh, rajasthan uh, highest point of rajasthan is mount abu okay and uh, in mount abu 
there is a temple that is Dilwara temple. Dilwara temple. Okay, Dilwara temple. Next question. So the important uh, national parks of uh, Rajasthan are Mukundra Hill National Park, Desert National Park, Kevla Dev Ghana National Park is very important, Ranthambore and Sariska National Park. These are five important national parks of Rajasthan. Okay. Ashok Gehlot is the chief minister of Rajasthan. Congress Sarkar government, government is there. Who has become the richest Asian as on 10th February 2022? So, uh, richest Asian, uh, the person has surpassed Mukesh Ambani. The correct answer is Gautam Adani. <coughs> Gautam Adani. Now, he is number one in India as, and as well as Asia. Okay. <coughs> so, the uh, total worth of uh, Gautam Adani is 90.1 billion US dollar. 90.1 billion US dollar. And while Mukesh Ambani is 90 billion. So there is a very slight, there is a very little uh, difference between the 100 million difference. 100 million difference is there. Okay. So next question. And in overall uh, world, what is his rank? What is the rank of Gautam Adani in all, all, all of the world? The his rank is 10th. He is at the 10th position in all over the world. And who is number one in the world? It is uh, Jeff Bezos. Jeff Bezos is number one. Next question. Rajasthan Chief Minister Ashok Gehlot and BCCI President Saurabh Ganguly laid the foundation stone of world's third largest cricket stadium in which city? So the correct answer is Pink City that is Jaipur, Pink City. So world largest, third largest cricket stadium will be uh, founded in, uh, will be uh, set up in uh, Jaipur, okay, the capital city of Rajasthan. And which is the largest stadium? cricket stadium of the world that is Motera Stadium and the new name of Motera Stadium is Motera Stadium and the new name of Motera Stadium is Narendra Modi Cricket Stadium Narendra Modi Cricket Stadium is the new name of Motera Stadium and it is located in Ahmedabad Ahmedabad and Ahmedabad is the India's first world heritage city. UNESCO India's first world heritage city is Ahmedabad. Okay. And what is the capacity of this uh, world largest cricket stadium? Uh, the capacity is 1,32,000 people. 1,32,000 spectators can watch the, can uh, see the uh, cricket match okay 132 and which is the second largest cricket stadium of the world that is mcg melbourne cricket ground of australia and its capacity is one lakh around one lakh okay one lakh capacity is melbourne cricket ground and the third will be the uh, jaipur okay clear third will be in jaipur next question Who has been reappointed chairman of Tata Sons for a second term of five years? So, who has been appointed that uh, reappointed the chairman that is Natarajan Chandra Sekhan. Natarajan Chandra Sekhan. Okay, he will be the chairman uh, for the second uh, term, second five year terms for Tata Sons. Okay. That, uh, that Tata Trust, who is the ch chairman of Tata Trust, the complete group, that is Ratan Tata. Which actor has been named named the brand ambassador of Uttarakhand? So, the actor is uh, the Kiladi, the Aksha Kumar. The correct answer is Aksha Kumar. Okay? Aksha Kumar. And uh, there are some important things I want to tell you about Uttarakhand. There are uh, six national parks that are very important for the point of Uttarakhand. Corbett National Park, the most important, Jim Corbett National Park. Gangotri National Park. Govind National Park. Nanda Devi National Park. Rajaji National Park. and Valley of Flowers National Park. 
these are uh, six important national park is located in, in Uttarakhand and uh, this question has come um, once in the RIMC which is the oldest national park of India so uh, uh, oldest national park of India Jim Corbett National Park Jim Corbett National Park that was uh, established on 1936 okay so the, you have to remember that oldest national park of India is Jim Corbett greatest largest national park of India is Hamish Hamish National Park and smallest national park of India is South Button National Park South Button National Park South or where it is located? It is located in Andaman and Nicobar Islands. It is located on Andaman and Nicobar Islands. And Hamish National Park is located in Ladakh. Okay. These are some important points that you have to remember about. Pushkar Singh Dami is the uh, Chief Minister of uh, Uttarakhand and Governor is Gurmit Singh. Gurmit Singh is the Governor of Uttarakhand. There are two capitals of Uttarakhand. One is Dehradun and another is Gershand. Gershand is the summer capital of Uttarakhand. In the year of uh, women's India Premier League will be started. Uh, till now, the men's Premier League is organized every year. So, from the year 2023, Indian Women Premier League will be uh, conducted. Okay. So, Women's Premier League will be organized from the year 2023. So, pride uh, that is a happiest moment for women cricket team, women cricket players. So, next, uh, next question. World United Day is observed on. So, World United Day is observed on 11th February. 11th February. Okay. And why do we uh, celebrate the uh, World United Day? World United Day is celebrated on 11th February to pay the tribute of Mahan, uh, greatest Yunani physician, educationist, that is Hakim Ajmal Khan. Hakim Ajmal Khan. In the name is Hakim. Hakim Ajmal Hakim Ajmal Khan. He was the greatest Yunani physician and educationist and founder of scientific research in Yunani system of medicine in India. So, to pay the uh, tribute uh, to Hakim Ajmal Khan, we celebrate World Yunani Day on uh, 11th February. Okay. So, next question. Recently, one ocean summit was organized by which country? So, one ocean summit was organized by France. The, uh, France. the capital of France is Paris. Capital of France is Paris. And there is an important uh, uh, international organization that is located in France, that is UNESCO. UNESCO. Okay. United Nations Educational Scientific Cultural Organization. Okay. And Israel capital is Jerusalem, China, Beijing, India, New Delhi. And China, uh, uh, Renminbi, Yuan is the currency, Shakil, France, Euro. Okay. These are some important points you have to remember about. Who will be the, who will be facilitated for the first time with the 18th late Madhavrao Limai Award. So, this award is given to the efficient member of parliament. Efficient member of parliament. This award given to the, that person. So, now, you can recall the name is Nitin Gadkari. He has received the award for the year 2020-21. He has been the most efficient member uh, for the year 2020-21 uh, member of parliament. Okay. The correct answer is Nitin Gadkari. And who is Nitin Gadkari? Gadkari. He is union, uh, union minister of uh, M-O-R-T-H. Minister of road and highways. Okay. Minister of Road, Transport and Highways and Nirmala Sitaram, Minister of Finance, Narendra Singh Tomar, Minister of Agriculture, Amit Saab, our Home Minister and Minister of Cooperatives. Which country recently became the first one in the world to administer COVID-19 DNA vaccine? So it is a very proud moment for India. So India has become the first country uh, to administer the uh, covid dna vaccine okay dna vaccine and which company has produced has uh, produced this vaccine jidas cadilla jidas cadilla 
जायडस कैडिला नेम ऑफ द वैक्सीन इज जेड वाई कोव डी जेड वाई कोव डी ओके टेक अ ब्रेक कैंपेन हैज बीन लॉन्च रिसेंटली बाय विच सोशल मीडिया प्लेटफॉर्म सो एज यू नोटिस विद योर सेल्फ मोस्ट ऑफ द टाइम्स आवर जनरेशन आवर पीपल एंगेज विद सोशल मीडिया लाइक एज व्हाट्सएप फेसबुक मेटा इंस्टाग्राम ट्विटर ओके दे डोंट टेक रेस्ट इवर ए सिंगल मिनट वेन एवर दे फ्री दे गो ऑन दी सोशल मीडिया प्लेटफॉर्म सो देर इज अ कैंपेन टू टेक अ ब्रेक ओके द करेक्ट आंसर इंस्टाग्राम द करेक्ट आंसर इज इंस्टाग्राम एंड द न्यू नेम ऑफ फेसबुक इज मेटा फेसबुक न्यू नेम इज मेटा यू हैव टू रिमेंबर दिस पॉइंट मेटा इज द पेरेंट ऑर्गेनाइजेशन ऑफ इंस्टाग्राम एंड व्हाट्सएप ओके व्हाट्सएप व्हाट्सएप इज द सब्सिडरी कंपनी ऑफ मेटा एंड वी द सी ई ऑफ ट्विटर ट्विटर सी ई ओ इज पराग अग्रवाल पराग अग्रवाल पराग अग्रवाल इज एंड इंस्टाग्राम एडम मोसेरी एडम मोसेरी एंड वी द चेयरमैन ऑफ मेटा दैट इज फेसबुक मार्क जकरबर्ग एंड व्हाट्सअप ब्रायन एक्टन ब्रायन एक्टन इज द चेयरमैन सी ईओ ब्रायन एक्टन इज द सी ईओ नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन हु इज द ऑथर ऑफ द बुक टाइटल एज अटल बिहारी वाजपेयी सो अटल बिहारी वाजपेयी बुक इज रिटन बाय सागरिका घोष सागरिका घोष सागरिका घोष एंड द बर्थडे ऑफ अटल बिहारी वाजपेयी इज सेलिब्रेटेड ऑन ट्वेंटी फिफ्थ दिसंबर एज गुड गवर्नेंस डे गुड गवर्नेंस डे गुड गवर्नेंस डे डे देर आर सो मेनी इंपोर्टेंट बुक्स दैट अवर फॉर्मर प्राइम मिनिस्टर लेट प्राइम मिनिस्टर हैज रिटर्न सम आर्स माई फिफ्टी वन पोएम्स माई फिफ्टी वन पोएम्स हार नहीं मानूंगा दिस इज अनदर बुक हार नहीं मानू आई विल नॉट एक्सेप्ट द डिफीट क्या खोया क्या पाया दिस इज अनदर बुक दैट has been written by atal bihari vajpayee and atal bihari vajpayee had been the uh, prime minister from the year 1998 to 2004 okay next question world pulse day is observed by united nation on which day so world pulse day is observed on 10th february the correct answer is 10th february 10th february is celebrated on world pulse day and what is the theme what is the theme theme is pulse says to empower youth in achieving sustainable agri food system this is the important you have to remember the theme which among the following forces has launched operation ahat to curb human trafficking because uh, as per the ncrb data nc national crime record bureau data around 2200 cases of human trafficking are registered every year okay so this is a serious problem the correct answer is rpf railway police force railway protection force so correct answer is option c officially recognized as the longest highway tunnel about 10000 feet by world book of records so the correct answer is atal tunnel the length of you have to remember the length of atal tunnel that is 9.02 km you have to remember this data okay and this this tunnel is this tunnel is built by Uh, BRO, BRO, Border Road Organization that is located in uh, the head office of BRO is New Delhi. Okay, next question. The International Day of Women and Girls in Science is observed by the United Nations on. So the correct answer is eleventh February. So uh, and what is the theme? The theme is the next question: Equity, Diversity, and Inclusion. water unites us this is the theme of international day of women and girls in science <clears throat> this day is very important you have to remember this day okay because this day is observed by united nation and uh, it is focus on the development of girls and women in the science sector today's burning question the question is very important to uh, nowadays i will uh, provide you i give you the question in bulk so these question match the following here is national parks and here is uh, states okay you have to match which national park is located in, in that particular state you have to answer okay 
so you have to answer the question in uh, comment box these are our courses you can avail our rms course jaguar courses chino courses for 9th and 6th both the these are our sani courses if you are preparing for the sani school upcoming 2023 exam then you can avail these courses these are our required courses if you like the video please uh, share the video like the video, share video share the video don't forget to subscribe the channel and mm, mm, and and uh, push the bell icon because whenever uh, you uh, uh, you uh, uh, activate the bell icon uh, as i uploaded the video you will get it notification and you will watch it as soon as possible if you watch the video at once during the exam all of the video that it will uh, be very difficult and the question will get mixed in your mind so it will be hard for you to remember all the questions during the exam in the exam hall you will forget those question while attempting the question so it is very important that you have to uh, watch the video regularly and not uh, watch I, I recommend you don't watch all the videos at once okay this will create confusion and you will not be able to uh, remember memorize all the questions at once so so regularity should be there consistency should be there so and uh, i bet you i uh, i i assure you these questions will help a lot in the exam especially r i m c and r m s okay so if you have any doubt you can whatsapp on this number and or either you can call these are our question number so student all the best thanks for watching